but I still have three pairs in that. I've sold a lot of the other ones because I like the colors and the colors go with the outfits that I have. <laughs> so that's important. What's up everyone, Sarah Grace here and today I have a little bit of a confession to make with you all. I do have an addiction and it is a shoe addiction. So I guess there could be worse things to have, but um, I really love workout shoes. Um, I'm in them like 90% of the time. So I need to have ones that go with all the different outfits I have and obviously that serve different purposes in the gym. So I decided I was gonna start a new series with you all to cover what some of my favorite workout shoes are and what I like about them. All right, so as you can see, most of the brands that I have are Reebok. Um, because I do CrossFit, obviously I love Reebok CrossFit shoes, but I do have Nikes, I do have Adidas, and there are things that I like about each brand. So for instance, Reebok One, this shoe here, I really like a lot. It's super, super lightweight, and I like it for cross training and running, but only if it's like short runs, nothing, not like a mile or longer. And then of course, I've had all of the Nanos that ever came out, like this one here, I've got a bunch of this Nano. This was one of my favorite ones, and this is the, um, the Seven, I believe. No, it's not the seven, this is the seven. So this Nano 7, I would say was probably one of my least favorite Nanos because it's really, really stiff, but I still have three pairs in that. I've sold a lot of the other ones because I like the colors and the colors go with the outfits that I have. <laughs> so that's important. So, um, this was one of my favorite nanos that ever came out and so i have like a bunch of these where are they all yeah i have like i think four um four or five in this nano and this one was a little more reminiscent of the first one that came out it's more like pliable you can run you can do your workouts in this so i really love that nano and then i have um the nano nines which are all of these three here are Nano 9s, I like them a lot. And then the brand new Nano X, and I will be getting into those more specifically. I also like the Reebok CrossFit Grace shoe. It's this one here. And this and the one I'm wearing are their original Reebok CrossFit Grace. And then this is the newer version of it, which I really like this shoe a lot. And this one's cool for running as well and training but um this one is a reebok one shoe this one as well both of these i like this is a great cross uh, training shoe for reebok one it's a lot flatter then of course i keep this nano because this was probably one of my most favorite nanos that they ever came out with the six i really loved this shoe so much but i sold most of them except for these two and this one is so beat up, but I keep it just because I love this shoe and I occasionally wear them, but I don't know, I'm not ready to get rid of them yet. And I really hate when my shoes get dirty. That's like a pet peeve of mine, so I do wash them. And then if it gets beyond the point of being able to wash them, then I'll get rid of them. And then, um, so with my Nikes, I have the Metcons. I've had like all of the Metcons, but I have sold a lot of them. I have a Poshmark and I sell them like really quickly on there. People love them as well as the Reeboks. But um, these are the Metcon 4s. I haven't gotten the brand new Metcon yet because I don't really like the style or the colors or any of it. I, I'm just not crazy about it. So. The fours are all that I have left right now. This, I loved this Nike Metcon Free. So it was kind of a little bit more of like their all purpose cross training sneaker. And this was the men's color and the size I got was just a little bit too small. So I don't wear them as often, but I do love the fit of the shoe is really cool. And then this is just the Nike Free, so it's not the Metcon. It's supposed to be kind of like a cross training shoe, so I do wear it sometimes, especially if there's more running involved. 
And then this one, this is one of my all time favorite Nikes. I wish I could get it in every single color that they have, the Nike Renew. I'm gonna be talking more about this shoe on my next video. And then we have Nike Running. We'll get more into those as well. And then this one, this one here is um, like more to me an athleisure shoe. It looks good, but it's not as functional. I personally wouldn't train in something that has this big of a heel, but um, if maybe you were just doing bodybuilding, you could, but not really like functional fitness. So these are like super old, but I love them because of the colors and they are actually probably one of the most comfortable sneakers I've ever had. These were like from back in the day, the fly knits. This is a newer version of the fly knit, but I sold my other ones that I had and now I just keep these because of the colors. This, these are like all purpose beat around sneakers that you can kind of do whatever and you could run, train in. And then of course my Reebok CrossFit lifters. Love these. It's time for a new pair of those. <laughs> and, oh, and then I've got the Adidas here, which I never work out in Adidas. I honestly can't really imagine working out in Adidas, but I do like the way they look so i wear them with like leggings and that sort of thing but i've never actually worked out in them i don't know i guess to me they seem like more of a, an athleisure shoe i like the way they look and this one here is really good for running reebok one as well all right so these are some of my shoes and like i said i'm going to be getting into more of the specifics about what i like about different brands and what they are good for so get ready for my next video is gonna be on my favorite cross training shoe. And then we're gonna be talking about running as well. And as always, be sure to check out my workout videos. I've got tons of body weight workouts. If you are still at home training and um, you can't get to the gym, or even if you're back in the gym, I've got all kinds of great workout videos. So go check them out and make sure you subscribe to my channel.